what's happening today? People can come in and browse the various exhibits that has been set up by primary, secondary schools, tertiary institutions, even nursery schools, the private and public sectors, NGOs. First of all, they can browse those exhibits. Then we have a number of hands-on exhibits where the kids can come and create various things. They can make ice cream, for instance. They can make slime. They can go outside and make bubbles under the tent. Or they can go over and interact with the robots and do coding and robotics. There's also animation. There's a flight simulator in the back. And there's Patsy, the Bajan avatar. You can ask her anything. We have around 65 exhibitors here today. And what are we hoping to achieve? From all... We are trying to bring science to the people. We want to popularize science and technology. We want to demystify it. And also, we want to celebrate science, all it has to offer, how it impacts our life. Because every single thing that we do has a genesis in science. The response has been phenomenal. We've had thousands of school children pass through over the, couple of, over the past two days. And now today, parents are coming back. The adults are coming in and they're bringing back the children because they want to interact with the robots some more. They want to do some more coding. They want to do some more hands-on activities. We even have a 3D printer. We are demonstrating our two 3D printers so they can get to see that as well. This is actually an annual event. The last time was 2020, but you remember in 2020 we closed as after the festival, the island was closed down because of COVID. So then it was 2021, 2022, we still were struggling with COVID, but we're past that now, so we're back out. We're up and running. So how does it compare then with 2020 when you started? Um, no, we actually started in 2019. But this program came out of an earlier program, SciTech Expo. And we had hosted that for, my department had hosted that for many years. But then we changed it because we wanted to help bring a different perspective. We are coming into the digital age as well. So there were different exhibits and a completely different approach. The tent is wonderful for this because it brings a kind of rustic feel that you don't get indoors. But um, it's an annual event and we're looking forward to next year.